Now you heard us say earlier what a whopper and as far as breaking records goes this is a really unusual one. A Cumbrian chef has smashed the world record for the largest scotch egg John Fell is fittingly from Egremont. He made a scotch egg weighing in at 11 kilograms on Saturday, almost twice as heavy as the previous best. See, what did you do with your weekend? <laughs> he had to use an ostrich egg for the centre. Around that, he wrapped 10 kilograms of sausage meat, apparently, so that's 10 of the 11. Um, John also added 32 hen's eggs to the mix, and to cover it, he used one and a half kilograms of breadcrumbs. That actually all adds up to more than 11 kilograms. I got my maths wrong there somewhere. So John, why are you hearing this mermaid chippy at Downleaf? Because uh, ridiculously I um, was contacted by a good friend of mine, Mike Lindley, and, uh, another, and Claudia, another, another good friend of mine, Hi Mike. How are you? Um, to see whether we can smash this world record of a large Scotch egg. Uh, the current record is 6.2 kilos, we're going to try Fingers crossed, we're going to try for around 10 kilos if we can today. Um, so the egg's going into boil. How long does that take to it'll boil up? Uh, it'll take an hour. So what kind of egg is it? That's an ostrich egg, right. uh, which weighed uh, one and a half kilos, or 1.563 kilos to be precise. Okay. So Claudia, are you the note woman? Yes, of course, I am. Right, off your phone, you're working. Yes, day 20. <laughs> right, cool. So Michael, this is your chippy. Yes. And uh, how do you feel about this like, astounding achievement, yeah. like, taking part in your chippy one Saturday morning? It's a great, it's a great challenge. Yeah? Fantastic. This is my lucky top. I never went with this top, but no, but don't put that. No, come on, this is your lucky top. Your lucky top. Why is it lucky? It's lucky because every time like I've done like something interesting, mm -hmm. I wore these and these jeans. Okay. Which is obviously not my official like uh, chef okay. uniform, but okay. but it's, it brings me luck. Okay. The ground on. Oh god, yeah. Pressure's on. Oh, shut up. <laughs> no. Zero. Come on. Right, so now it's going to zero. So we're putting the bread first in. So the, the bread crumbs. Two point. Two kilos, 60 grams. Well. Just make sure that this is your handwriting here. Oh, it's so beautiful, eh? No, in just case it's. Oh, great. bread, bread crumbs, bread crumbs. Well done. Yeah, for the record, for the Guinness, yeah, absolutely, thanks. And now we're gonna weigh them in in ounces. Cheers. Cheers. One. And then ounce. Perfect. It's so great you're doing this. It's alright. It's really, it's really bad. Okay, bread from are Right, okay, now we're gonna weigh the milk. So the Guinness, they ask, they demand like ounces and grams, yeah? That was an outstanding pour. That was one of the best pours I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. It's in the years of practice. Okay, okay. Pouring milk. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so it's a uh, two kilo seven So how does a man with such an accent as yourself decide to like make the world's biggest Scotch egg? <laughs> um, just like food leaf. Just yeah, just through. Um, it was yeah. As I said, it was a. It was a. I was I was asked by Claudia and Mike if I'd be a judge on this year's um, Egg Awards, mm -hmm. and it was a late night conversation after a few glasses of wine between us. 
and we thought how can we promote it, how can we promote the awards to make it a bit more high, uh, mm -hmm. high profile and we decided that we'd try and break a record um, and it was decided that we'd break the Scott, try and break the Scotch Egg record and obviously you know these guys um, you know they know they know Michael from the Mermaid, and um, we decided we'd do it in Leith. And what, why not? What a fantastic place! Um, been made to feel really welcome. We've commandeered Michael's place, and you can't really you can't really say fairer than that. So thank you very much for that. And um, and we'll, let's just hope that we can do it. Mm. I don't see any reason why we can't. So. So what's the current record? The current record, as it stands at the minute, is uh, six point two kilos. Mm -hmm. um, and that's the official record. There has been another one, which is another, which is unofficial, and that was done by um, the Fortnum and Mason um, department store in London, which is apparently where, apparently is where, apparently is where Scotch eggs uh, originated. Apparently they say they made made them, but you, you think really that Scotch eggs in the name. Yeah. But, um, uh, and theirs was just under seven kilos, and we've had a couple of trial runs, and we've. Both have been around the sort of the 10.9 kilo, oh. so we're well, we're well. And as long as we stick to, there are a lot of rules and regulations that we've got to adhere to from from Guinness World Records. No, as you... long as we do that, which is you know, and we do it properly, um, we should we should we should smash it. Crack on! Yeah, we should crack it. Crack on! <laughs> what kind of egg do you need to break world records? What kind of egg is that? Ostrich. Hey, you should tell them the story about the ostrich egg. Hey, you should tell us the story about okay, the ostrich egg. egg. Um, oh. Sorry, oh, no, it's alright, just shutting the door so I can hear. Yeah, can I go outside? Yeah, shut the door, please. Okay, the story behind the ostrich egg is ostriches only lay between May and September. And obviously we're in we're in October. I had um I had two ostrich eggs spare, uh -huh. which, which which we had. Um but I knew that we needed to do um, another trial run, or at least another couple of trial runs. So I went to the, uh, the company that in England from Lincolnshire that we were getting the ostrich eggs from, right. who, who then told me that we don't have any. Uh, <gasps> I rang a good five or six other different companies in England, uh, up and down the breadth of the country. Nobody had an ostrich egg. Uh, so I found a lady in uh, Mexico who Breers and breeds ostriches and asked her if she had an egg. I rang her, no idea what the time was, time all day or night. Uh, I rang her and she picked the phone up, she was absolutely fantastic. She said, Yes, we've got some, uh, and yes, I can send it to you. Uh, and that happened. Uh, she posted it to us on the um, Tuesday, and it arrived in England on the Friday, and it's been stuck in customs down in Heathrow for a week. So in a nutshell, a Mexican ostrich egg is being boiled up at the bottom of Leith Walk. Basically. Cool. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. why is that important, taking the temperature? Because, because it's part of... No, it's here, the egg goes as well. That's when we started boiling the water, the egg goes inside the pot at 828. Right, so... It's all... It's all... The reason we've got to do it this way is because it's all... The um, the rules and the regulations that Guinness World Records have sent us. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, otherwise we could we could cheat, we could we could do things yeah, wrong or or whatever. Um, so they've given us a list of rules and regulations that we need to adhere to, and part of that is recording everything. It's recording the size of the egg, the weight of the egg, the weight of the sauce. Da, 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 da. Yeah, there's there's lots of different things. So um, and we obviously want to do it because we want to break the record. So uh -huh, we want to do okay. it. We want to do it right. And. Uh, as part, oh sorry, as part of the rules, uh, are you going to be tested for performance enhancing uh, narcotics uh, during the yeah, process I, of this? Apparently, it, I, I might get called in afterwards apparently, uh -huh. uh, just to make, that's why I didn't have too much to drink last night as well, well okay. just in case. And Claudia, do you have to provide a urine sample uh, for the... <laughs> what? No. <laughs> <laughs> Now. <laughs> yeah. Get away. Well, that, that's, that's the bottle's yeah, empty. Yeah, yeah, okay. Just keep drinking plenty of water. Yeah. yeah. Just, yeah. No, yeah. provide a sample. Is it first? Oh, right. I was going to tell you why we were here. No, wait, 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 seriously. No, I'm joking. You, 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 you should have done it. Yeah, you should have done it. Oh, I don't. No. <laughs>
Oh, really? Get it in there. Have you seen? Are you not seen that? Have you? Have you seen oh, that? What is this? That's um, uh, you know. Are you a shin? I right, shin yeah. Oh man, that is I've fantastic. Got two, um, what is this? Oh, these are fabulous. These are one of the. They um, they're actually, as well. Yeah, they're actually donated. Yeah. They're actually sponsoring. They're sponsoring the egg awards. I don't know if you can get that on there. Actually, can you see? Can you? See, oh my can you goodness, that? that is I'll fabulous. Get that. I'll, I'll get that. I'll oh, get that. Oh wow, fabulous. I'll get that. I'll get that. It says. It says egg award. It's even got a hashtag on it. Fabulous. Let me get that. Star, man. Ah, it's a bit bloody. Yeah, wow. Yeah, Still need to crumb it, egg it and crumb it, aren't we? But you can just keep wrapping, yeah, you can just, you can just keep roll, rolling it and rolling it and rolling it. Because I was even, even thinking that Why I could use this? some of it to lower it, lower it in and out. That's One like this and another one like this. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Don't forget I'm a designer. Very nice. <laughs> she's going to want to put a bow on it, isn't she? <laughs> so has the sausage arrived yet? Yes. Yeah, we've got the, we've got the, the sausage. sausage. We're still waiting for um, the sausage is in there. We're still waiting for Mr. Bang, Mr. Bangers to arrive with the scales, but he's um, but he delivered the sausage meat yesterday, so we're all sausage. The sausage meat we've got, the egg we've got, sausage meat we've got, bread crumbs we've got, the eggs and the milk to coat it with. We're, so we're all really we're all systems go. Excellent. So, do you add in any of your own like super spices and? Well, this is um, this is James's. Is, uh, the meat is James's recipe. So, when James finally gets here, he'll give us. Uh, but he's come up with this um, because we needed we needed the the actual meat mix to be quite because of the sheer size of it. Uh -huh. The sheer size of the, the Scotch egg that we're doing. Um, the meat, the, the the actual meat part of it needs to be quite sturdy, quite stiff, rather than quite wet, because mm -hmm. it, it needs to stay, the big, well as you've seen, the biggest issue that we've got is it needs to, to, to keep its shape. Mm -hmm. um, we are going to wrap it in muslin, so it, it keeps it nice and nice and round, but the meat itself, otherwise because of the sheer weight of the meat, it just sl keeps, it just slides off and just uh, and won't stay in shape. So James has come up with a, with a recipe. Um, and when James gets here, we'll, we'll, we'll have a chat with him and, and uh, he can tell us actually what, he, what he's put in it. So. Okay. So, the eggs had um, all but two hours, basically. So we've, we've really hard boiled it just to make sure that there's no possibility, because we don't have a spare, uh -huh. we've, um, so that there's no possibility of it being crushed by the, because this is one of the problems is that, um, We've got the because of the, the weight of the meat on the egg that we're not going to crush it, so okay. we really, really hard build it. So it's had a, it's had a good two hours. Okay, well, so we'll get one more pun from Catherine Wood, and she says, "Shall we just get, shall we get on with this?" But shall we? We like this. Shall <laughs> we get on with this? This is fantastic. Okay, so here we go. Yeah. <laughs> shall we put it in the ice? Yep. Yeah, okay, let's come and put it in the ice. Ah, uh, you know what? Wait. Oh. There. That's a trophy for the winner of the Egg Award 2013. You can put it back now if you want. Yeah. Just to make it cool down quicker, we're actually going. We're now going to crack it. We're just going to take it out of its shell and then put it back into the okay. um, back into the cold water. But what we're just what we're doing now is we're just going to just going to wait again just to make sure that we've not. Um, okay. Okay, it shouldn't realistically. It shouldn't make any. It shouldn't really have made any di difference. So that's yeah. what one point yeah. five five six. Yep. Get 
lightly. How does it squeeze that out? That's a big egg, isn't it? Yeah, it's quite frightening, isn't it, really, when you think about it. Good. 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 They're a bit pedantic. So, that's it. Almost 42 dead on, is it? Yeah. You think? Yeah. Yep. Happy? Yeah. 42 centimetres. Seems a shame now, doesn't it? Does, doesn't it? As you, well, you can you can see, you can see how thick the, uh, the shell is. It's actually it's really quite mm. yeah, it's really quite thick. Okay, it smells nice. So we'll just peel the peel it. Oh, look, you've already broken our record. Look. <laughs> You can see see what I meant by the colour of the yep. the colour of the white. It's it's really it's a really strange. It's got a really strange. The yolk it, the yolk is is as a as a normal egg yolk, but the the white is a strange. It's like a light mustard. Yeah, it's, it's, it's nice a nice smell. Mm. It's really nice. That's my after shoot. Maybe maybe that's something else we should do. Uh, we'll, we'll go into it. Yeah, that's, we'll, an, that's another video. That's another. That's another for maybe for another time. <laughs> so you're going to read this our fortunes. It's like a, a crystal ball. Like yeah. A ball. Just, how much did you have to shell out for that? This. Uh. Now I always see. I see what you did there. Right. Well, um, they're actually uh, twenty quid each. They're actually twenty quid each. Right. It's twenty. It's twenty pound an ostrich egg from from the um, place that. Um, we're using in uh, Lincolnshire, but uh, the one that I was shipping from abroad cost me 120 quid. Okay. <laughs> just to call it, just okay. to call it down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm calling you. I think it's because you do a picture of you like that with your kilt, and like. It's not that funny, mate. There we go. Little lost trees, yeah, floating in a chip and sing. Or you want to keep uh, this so as a memento? Yeah, uh, you well. want to keep this as a memento? What we're going to do is now is we're going to start while the egg's cooling. We're going to start by just lining these bowls, which we're going to use just to mould the egg. Okay. Sure. Um, so we need to weigh out. We need to weigh out. Um, we need to weigh out the, the sausage meat so that we know exactly how much sausage meat that we've got. And a half kilo. Yeah, each. perfect. Yeah, okay. Yeah, and then that way yeah. we know. Good idea. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Just because yeah. um, the sausage is being weighed. <laughs> <laughs> This is just to have the process though, because what counts for the breaking the world Guinness of record is the total weight yep. once the, the, the finished egg, yeah? Yep. Yeah. This is just so that they see the process and, you know, it's all... This is what Saturday morning should oh, be. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Give me a second. So, on. Are you doing it on pounds? Gram uh, oh, did you do, did, did, did you get the grams, get the grams? Did you get the grams for that one? No, but we can just form it. Yeah, we could. Yeah, we could. Yeah. Two kilo and a half, right? So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? Six, seven, eight, nine. Only with with that meat, with until C and the egg, we've got nine kilo, right? 
Okay. So the record will be broken. Cool. Yeah? Yeah. Good morning. Hi. Hi. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to just press press this down into the so that we make sure mm -hmm. we've not got any air and it's just one solid piece. Okay. Okay, so right. pretty much there's no air in there. Okay, so that's the first one. Right. And what we'll do is when we get the egg, we'll just make a three hole. Just make a hole in the. What we don't want is we don't want any air around the egg because mm -hmm. that's when that's when we get collapsed. That's when we get that's when we get collapsed, which which we've had in which we've had in <laughs> trial which we've had in trial. So. So do you need a firm hand whilst you're getting the air out your sausage? Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I could really go and answer that one. Well. <laughs> Are you from where? Sorry. You. I'm just I'm doing it for the daily record. Oh, right. Okay, so that's the two moulds. And then when we're uh, what we'll, then what we'll do is we'll make a we'll make a well. Uh huh. We'll sit the egg in it. In fact, what we'll do is we'll use this, the smaller one and we'll turn that. Mm -hmm. But what we're not allowed to do, which we have, which we haven't anyway, but we're not allowed to go any wider than the width of the egg. Yeah. If that makes, if that no. makes sense. <laughs> oh, baby! Yeah. Oh, it's cold. It's cold. Yeah, it's cold. Okay. So it's been in, nice and chilled. <laughs> Thirty minutes in ice water just to cool down. Excellent. Uh, it still feels rather wobbly. <laughs> I'm sure we're going to be fine. So we'll just get away. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Look at that. Oh, the chop shop we used to sell yeah. scotch. But they're coming back in fashion. Yeah. yeah. Deep fried. They'd better be sauce. after this. Huh? They'd better be after this. Inch and centimeter. Just, just give me a sec. Right, so this is, let's say, 13. 13? Right? Are you doing anything with the before you You're alright for a while, because I'll just have to get Yeah, no. Yeah, it's perfect. Yeah. So it's 13. That mean, that is 13, yeah? Yeah. Or 12. You would say that's 12. 12 width? The width is 12. Yeah. Yeah. And we're perfect. The guidelines perfect. It's so it's just yeah. so that when we're cooking it, when we're probing it, we know yeah. how far we've got to. Yeah. We know how far we've got I to go it. in. Yeah. So twelve. Need, um... Let me write it down. The width of the egg. Okay. So did I say 12? 12 centimeters. Yeah. Twelve centimeters. I'm sorry. I'm gonna do the length again. Do you know Antonio? He's no. uh, the owner of the mermaid. You're the owner. Oh, nice to meet you. Pleasure. All right. Yes. <laughs> Nice to meet you, Chef. It's good to meet you. I'll right. check, check you. <laughs> it's okay. Well, thank you very much okay. for... Um, no problem. You know, you must think them bonkers, like, but... No, no. The, my only worry is it was that this wouldn't fit. Mm. Well, that was... That wasn't tight. But it's, it's, I think we're going to be... I think we're going to be fine. Okay. I think we're going to be... Um, and probably we need to keep on turning it. Yeah, we're going to need to keep moving it round. Just so that... It, 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 it's got to cook even anyway, but it's just so it doesn't start catching on the Are bottom. Are you going to boil it first? Uh, no, we're just gonna wrap. We're gonna wrap it in. We're gonna wrap it in muslin, okay, okay. and then we're gonna we're gonna just drop Maybe it straight in. Okay. It's thirteen. Uh, it's thirteen. Muslim as well. No, I said at this years. stage because I'm an passionate of uh, kitchen, as you can see by yeah. my size, <laughs> and I watch your program all the time. At this stage, you will say that's the one I made. Yeah, ever. it would be so good, <laughs> wouldn't it, if we could do that? Oh yeah, I'm doing it ready. Yeah, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it be so good? Yeah. Right, so okay, we're gonna try. I'm gonna try if we can. And just Yeah. 
huge. <laughs> it's just mad, isn't it? What on earth are we doing? That's a nice what? kilt, by the way. That's just do like, just, yeah, just, just, just do the kilt. Yeah, I'll just get the kilt and the sausage yeah, in the, the same kilt. shot. Got even the uh, the skin view, fabulous. Yeah. yeah. That's what he's going to use to probe it. No, that's to um, to, to uh, stab it, <laughs> cut it. You know what I was thinking? That's a good. That's a good sausage meat. It's very sticky. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. It's very good. Here's my thing. Just don't want any. Um, I don't want any any cracks. Okay. Do it. Turn it. Turn it over. If we can. All right, Squire. How are you doing? I'm all right. How are you? Uh, yeah. I'm all right. I think. Can you just. Right. Yeah. Yeah. He's coming. Yeah. 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 Cool. How do you feel? Sweat. Sweat. How do I feel? I'm sweating like a hooja. Um, um, it's. Uh, no, I'm. I'm nervous. I have to say, but I think. I think we're going to do it. Uh, nice hand work there. I do, I do think. Thank we're gonna you. Do it. Just I'm slabbing it a bit so that yeah. like to all this. Yeah. Okay. So this is, a gentleman just walked in with his lovely wife Heather and uh, Hello. this is um, James of um, Heather, of Bobby's Bangers Fames oh, who have Bobby's very Bangers. very kindly donated the sausage meat. So but thank you very much. This is your sausage well, there. So is the sausage okay? The sausage is fantastic, thank you. It's, um, it's one of the best sausages of, yes. As, as we have our world famous company here, um, we found a nice old Cumberland sausage recipe. So we've got uh, a little bit of marjoram, some sage, some black pepper, some nutmeg in there, um, pork shoulders, a um, little bit of rusk, a little bit of water, and a lot of love, really. Fantastic. And um, you see, because the whole thing as well is it has to, not only do it need to be big, we've obviously, it needs to taste. Yeah. It needs to taste right. So, as James has said, he's come up with a, found this old Cumberland sausage recipe and... So how does the sausage taste? This, the sausage is very nice, nice and peppery, plenty of herbs in there, a bit of the sage, the sage is great, and then the nutmeg, we tried without the nutmeg and it just wasn't right, but the nutmeg, there's not a lot of fat in there, that, you know, he didn't want it too fatty, so it keeps some nice shape with there, a bit of texture in there, it's a bit, should be perfect. So fingers crossed, all being well, we should, <laughs> we should have a record. Nice. Excellent. High quality so, sausage. Uh, high quality yeah. sausage. Brilliant. Look at that. You want it in the fridge for a bit? Or I think not? So. I think I'm gonna. I think huh? I'm gonna. Yeah, I think I'm put gonna. Put it in the fridge it. for a bit. Yeah. Um, Covered in the muslin so it doesn't stick, or we just put a cover. Just put a cover around. Yeah. It. Okay. The one I did, I did a trial run on Saturday. Oh well, man, that's heavy. Mate, right. I was, I was, I was, Michael. I was, I was yes. Please come and give me a hand. Oh my foot! This is super heavy. That's a nice salmon skin spotting. Very well done, designed by one of the founders of the Just Love Food, Claudia Escobar. So did you design this? Yes, of course. Yes. A one-off, unique. That was for uh, Tartan Week in New York, 2011. Yeah. Or 12. Yeah, don't remember. <laughs> but this is uh, salmon skin. Right. Why is it wet? So. Uh, salmon skin and uh, deer skin. Uh -huh. Okay, deer antler. And inside a Scottish goat. Right. right. So it's Scottish all recycled goat material, sweet. but it's all. Yeah. Cameraman, have a feel of that. <laughs> it's all recycled. <laughs> <laughs> it's all recycled material. Okay. What do you think? Hey, look, let me get the sketch out. Oh, it's the biggest scotch egg. Oh, sorry. Yeah, it's the biggest scotch egg. It's exciting, isn't it? A giant How scotch egg. going to be? It's over 10 kilograms. What's that in real money? That's About like this you? size. About that? Is that all? Yeah. <laughs> what do you mean is that all? That? Roll it down a hill, sorry. We're just, weighing, we're just weighing out the breadcrumbs just to make sure. So, we've got we've got 2.10 kilos of breadcrumbs. Um, we're obviously not going to need all of these, but... but How many kilos? 2.10? 2.10. 2.10. So that's the that's the breadcrumbs for the baby. Well, I mean, Perfect. Fabulous. Yeah. 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 
I just made that. I'm going to weigh the egg and the, the eggs. And, um, okay, so. Going to be with these eggs as well. We're going to do, yeah, we're going to do the milk and the milk. Yeah. Right, cracking eggs or? Yeah. Right, cracking eggs, right. So, I'm going to do the eggs. Right. Right. Okay. So, just. Of egg wash, yeah? Yeah. So, eggs on their own and then with the milk or egg wash only? Uh, I'm going to do eggs and milk. Together. To, together. So, yeah. just, to sh just to show that we are, the reason, the reason that we are doing what we're doing is because we're trying to promote. <laughs> local free range eggs so we're using true Scottish free range eggs yeah. only, only the I'm shell can tell I know and so there we go and only this uh, now as you can see we're stamped happy days first class first class excellent okay. so, so this is the milk this is milk you prepared earlier yes look okay. yeah, I went to milk the cow really early like at three in the morning oh from a cow <laughs> One. You need a hand, John, or Go on, yeah, let's get yeah. two. Let's get Let's count, yeah, life yeah. counting. Oh, you so I'll smash. You smash. One each. Come on. One each. One each. So why do you need all these eggs? Well, because because we need we need to coat for the egg coat wash. the egg. Yeah, we need to egg wash the egg to enable the um, to enable the the breadcrumbs to actually stick to the to the Scotch egg. So that's why we're. Uh, Piece of thing, can you? Mm -hmm. Or is it high? I'll get a spoon then. Yeah, cool. And we have that's more. It, that's it. Is that it? Right, cool. So that's all the eggs. That's all the eggs. So put your um, you can put your milk in, and I'll just um, okay. Yep, yeah, milk, and then we've got we've got the full weight. But we're of not putting all the milk, are we? Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait, wait. Yeah, the cows harmed in the milk. Yeah, I'm not <laughs> <laughs> there you go for it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, would yeah, okay. yeah, because we want it really sticky. Sticky, yeah. So you've uh, got. Drop all a bit more and make up to two. Right. Yeah, two and up, yeah. Round it up. It's sound like we're not Oh! Yeah. Yeah. Right, well, you couldn't. You couldn't yeah. not, I'm gonna, <laughs> I just hope the rest of my day is as lucky as that. <laughs> milky, milky. Fancy. <laughs> oh. So why is this nerve wracking? Um, because now it, it's, it, it becomes quite, it, because of the shiz, thanks, because of the shiz. Thanks Claudia. Um, just because of, just because of the size of, size of the thing, we've got to now try and coat it in the, in the milk and the eggs. No, that's fine for it. We've got to try and, We've got to try and coat it in the egg and the milk right. and get it into the breadcrumbs, coat it in the breadcrumbs and then get back into the egg. Uh -huh. We're gonna give it two, we're gonna give it two coats. Uh -huh. And then we've got to try and then we've got to try and thank you very much. That's what you call a whisk, you see. That's good. Okay. Right. Sexy leg. <laughs> I'm trying to get one of me up my... Uh, no, 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 I'm just following you. Oh, right. Let's go. Right. Sausage okay. from the fridge. So you keep your sausage fridge. in the fridge. Sausage from the fridge. Are we... Ah, right. Yeah? Yeah. Here we go. Right. So you need, are you going to need a handle? Yeah, I'm going to need a handle. Yeah. Okay. I've got two of them. I might, yeah, I might need two or, th I might need two or three hands really. Yeah. Okay. So here we go. It will start to lose its shape, but we're just going to have to... Yeah, we'll mold it this way. Yeah, just... Okay. Right. Hey! That's the CGI of the egg. Oh, sorry, sorry. We need... We need to egg... Egg with all. Right, wait, wait. We're going to, like, rub it. Rub it so it's not chunky. Right? No, and then... Wait, wait. 
Yeah. And this full again? Yeah, I'm just going to fill it once more. And then what I'll do is we'll put anything that's left on the muslin. Yeah, as we okay, wrap, as we fantastic. Wrap it. Yeah. Right. Right. Ready? What do you Right, okay. Put over and over your way. I'm just going to go over my way. Right, we set that off now. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. I'm sorry. Okay. Right, that's right. good. Now the next job is... Muslim. Muslim. Okay, give me a second. We are going to do it. Uh, I need a bowl. Which is the longest? Yeah. Which is the longest one? So did that go well? Yeah, that was. That, to be honest, it, like I, it, like I said earlier, really, the um, the problem is it's just the sheer size of it, and it's it's not like just having yep. the little Scotch eggs that you see in the shops. Mm -hmm. This is this is huge, and it's it's the actual coating of it, and trying to keep its shape, uh -huh. um, and try you know just trying to, um, tr and then and of course you, trying to be as gentle you're trying to be as gentle as you can because obviously you don't you don't want you don't want to damage the egg in the last thing you need is to damage the egg inside. So, um, Let's come on. So what we're going to do, what we're going to do now is we're going to we're going to wrap it. We're going to put some sheets of muslin down. Just spread that with breadcrumbs, put the egg onto that, and uh -huh. then wrap it nice and tight mm -hmm. so it keeps its shape. And then hopefully, fingers crossed, let's do it. Right. Because we're going to need to walk. Give me a second. Are you ready? Um, Are you, no, no. Yeah, I'll tell you what, put that on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. put that on first. Okay. Okay, wait, now, no, wait, wait, wait a second. This needs to go this way. Yeah. This way. Yeah. Right, it's all there sorted. Yeah. And now we need to lift it from the bottom. One, two, three. Mm -hmm. right. Going right. Yes, and now turn it out. Yeah. Turn it I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. So we're gonna turn yep. it. Cool. That? Right. Spread yep. that. So if that comes off, we can get some more. Yeah. So get rid of that. Absolutely. Um. Let's get rid of the excess that we don't need, really. Yeah, the excess. You know, look at look at the size of this uh, compared to this is a human skull here, yeah. a massive skull, skull. <laughs> and, and this is an egg, well, a, a Scotch egg. Right, listen, it's massive. I need to say something. <laughs> I hope these guys are going to clean up your shop after this. I hope they're cleaning up. Because you guys are making some mess in here. Antonio, we're going to need to redecorate. No, it's not. You've done that before. Yes. When I was milking the cow this morning. You did that to the cow to okay. milk it? I was going to say, yeah. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what to say about that. Or did you just like knot it up so to save some for later? You know, where is he? I hope you're not using his Wi Fi to get some dodgy torrent site up, mate. Right, John. So, we're going to weigh this monstrosity. Okay. Thirteen? Thirteen. Oh Thirteen point zero eight five. So how how long is that going to take to cook? Three hours I would say, John. Yeah. Thank you. I think we'll go for it. Let's take a picture of that. Six point two. So we've doubled it. <laughs> God, it's not like smashing it, is there? <laughs> well, what did I say? I said if we're gonna do it, let's do it right, you know? Right, so thirteen. I mean, even if we subtract. No, no, that would be. Look, it's negligible, that. Yeah. Isn't it? yeah. It like no. that, that, this would be. We use two? Yeah. We yeah. use two, right? Yeah. Put this guy Yeah. <laughs> that would. I thought I'd connect to them. It's just, it's all bought. Yeah, yeah, it? It's all bought. Yeah, yeah. It's all it doesn't bought matter, you know why? Because we're gonna, when we wait for the record, uh, we're gonna take it off. Yeah, 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 that's true. Yeah? Right. right. So, here we go. Okay, guys. Happy days. So what sort of temperature does the pan have to be to cook this? We're starting it off. Because what? <laughs> because... Because what we what we want is um, we want the we want it to seal quite quickly. 
um, to keep its shape. That's the initial thing. So we're going to start it off. Antonio, Antonio, bless him, has set it to 190. Set, set it to 190. 190 was quite high, though. Yeah. So we'll, and we'll what, give it 10 minutes. I think we'll give it. Mm. I think we'll give it 10 minutes at 190. Then we'll lower it to 140. Cool. Um, and then we're just going to keep moving it, moving it round, keep basting it, and keep testing the temperature. Um, in, keep probing it, testing it until it's cooked. Uh, so hopefully, I think we're looking at what two, two and a half. I think we're looking at probably three, three hours. Two, three, yeah, <laughs> probably three hours. <laughs> no, the way today, the way today's gone, midnight tonight. But, uh, I'm hoping for customers. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's, it's, <laughs> it's Saturday. <laughs> So happy days. Shall we? Um, oh, still, still just waiting. So still no, 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 no. Just waiting. To no. So is that the peak of your career? I think it has to go down. Really, doesn't it? Yeah. You know. If we if we fail, if nothing else, at least at least I've met some fantastic people. I'll probably never be allowed back in Edinburgh ever again. Oh, not for another fifteen years. Not for another fifty. Yeah, not for another fifteen years. No, no, it's um, yeah, cool. I mean, I mean, great. If we see it in black and white from Guinness that we've done it, then that's then you know, we'll go on to something else. We'll do an omelet next year. <laughs> Wait, that's ready. Are we ready? Yes. Okay, so here we go. We're about to go in. It won't fit. <laughs> we ready? Yeah. Three, two, one. Now he's toilet though because he's shaking. I can confirm it is frying. Is this frying? It will not destroy your hair. It looks great, trust me. It's for the sweat. <laughs> like a pirate! It's fantastic! So why is this needed? Because I, need I, now need, I now need to turn it over. Because obviously the oil's coming up just to halfway. Mm -hmm. So obviously the bottom's cooking. So I now need to turn it, turn it over to okay. let, let the top. Huh? You can, of course, you should. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Um, and we're, we're basting it constantly, basting it with the hot oil, so that it's cooking evenly all the way, all the way around. And it's just going to take as long as it as it yes, takes. But um, you know. Fingers crossed. It's so the, the the drama is over. It's just a case of well, cooking this, it. This is it now. It's just yeah. The drama's over. Really, it's just it's just cooking it now. That's the that's the that's the main issue. So the egg is not split. The, the, well, the egg's not split. The, the, we kind of it kind of looked like the outer it's, was starting to split, which is why I was worried that we, I, we needed to get it out and flip it over. Really, um, because. If you catch it early enough, obviously it hasn't had time to set, so the sausage meat will then it will set and hopefully it will. Uh, but um, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. No. <laughs> Are you eating? Oh God, up place. We can't do that. Tasting the scotch Brilliant. So what did you do for three hours? I pasted this one. I filmed it. Yeah, who's the 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 who
to turn it? 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 Turn Speech. Uh, I'm off down the boozer. <laughs> So we'll leave it to rest. We're going to leave it to rest. We're going to need it. I'll give, we'll give it 20 minutes. We'll take we'll take it out of its thingy, and then we'll um, and then and then we'll, uh, we'll we'll make sure we'll weigh it. We need to weigh it first. We'll weigh it, measure it, record it, and then um, and then we'll cut it up, and you lot can eat it, and um, I'll be down having a few. I'll rejoin you. Yeah, well, I'm down having a few. That's big again. Did you turn it on first? Maybe 4 500 grams? Fucking hell, oh sorry. Looks like a, don't know, a lot of severed head. It's just been like... Well, you can have something you found in a river. Yeah, so what's happening, it's getting weighed. Weight's being weighed. Up there, up there. What you do is you take the egg out of the egg. And also the muslin. So all the egg. And the egg. And that tray would be fine. Slightly, slightly well done in places. It doesn't matter. You need a muesli. Can I have a bit of protein? Yeah. Ah, right, cool. Brilliant. Well done. So we're mm -hmm. whole and we want to see it. We want to see it whole. The people want to see it. You know. Um, I'm shaking like a something. Just starting yeah. to start. Yeah. Six, 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 he wants that, doesn't he? Again, put it the other side is more attractive. Like I say, we're a, we're a little bit darker than what we wanted, but I think that was the first initial when we went in, so we knew that we'd got issues then. But when they blue. Listen, for the size of it. No, I know. Fine. Boy's banging. Nice TV. Boy's absolutely banging. Superb. Okay. Yeah. I think it looks good. Do you want to take it through, Johnson? Yeah, I think it's like a dinosaur egg. You want me to do it? Okay, what? Yeah, you go. I'll follow you. <laughs> Congratulations, John. It's a boy.
Thanks very much. So what is the official weight of the egg? The two here. Huh? 10, 12.26. Oh, we'll just pile in there. Now, just come in there, John. Yeah. Oh, you stay there. Everyone else pile in. This one first. This one first. Maybe there is 20 kilos. Okay, guys, this one first. This one first. Get in there. Quite home. I'm going to see. Excellent. We just need a little bit of it. Are you sorted? Yeah, okay. Do it again, Michael. You can do it a little bit there. Come on, squeeze in. Excellent. 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 Extra. 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 Half one open. A bit high. Okay. Good. Good view of the egg. Okay. Good. Yeah, good. Yeah. 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 No, it reminds me that dish, an Italian dish called porchetta, uh, similar. <laughs> The yolk's not even that fully I'm hard. Fancy, I'm not fancy to do it. No. You need some salt. You need some salt. <laughs> so we're going to put it what? The meat shrunk though, hmm? because when I, I measured, well, this is, you know, it should be like this big, yeah? So if I measure from, okay, so that's what I've said, well, I'll say that. Okay. So we're looking at right. 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 And then I suppose that's going to be an equivalent. So if you want me to measure this distance here, yeah. this distance. That's the width of your footage. Yeah. 25 for the meat. Yeah. So the half of that is 12 and a half. Yeah. Okay, that's going that way. Yeah. If we go this way, yeah. we've got 12 for the egg. 15 for the meat, so that's seven and a half either side. That's fantastic. So, so the width of the bag is greater than the width of the meat. Yeah, yeah, on average, on average. Okay. On average, okay. fantastic. On average. Let's eat it. Okay. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. 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 It's official. It's official. Can you just have a round of applause for Antonio and the guys for letting us uh, do this? Thank you. So thanks very much. Um, an absolute, you're an absolute legend. Thank you very much. You've been, you've been, you've been, you've been, you've been brilliant. <laughs> Yeah, that's my support. Right, show you three. Thanks a lot. Okay. That's my daughter. Yeah. Alright, okay. I don't say Although, that, she's passing. My sister's. Right, you want to try? I'll bring a little more plate. Yeah. You get a bit of that sausage. That'll be really good. Do you like that sausage? Pop up at it. Pop up at it. Have a bit of sausage. How does it taste? Actually really nice, like the middle of a sausage roll. <laughs> yeah, the middle of a sausage roll, but the, the sausage. But the sausage bit, the best bit. So how is it? Is it tasty? Scottish. Bye! Bye! Bye. <laughs> right John, I'm going to wrap this up right, with the final pun that was sent in yeah. by Liam Young. And that's all yolks. That's all we've got, yolks. Yeah. We like that one. Right. That one good. John, well done. Thanks very much, mate. It's been, um, it's been a long day. Thank you very much. Um, and yes, we've done it. Fantastic. Brilliant. It's with John at the Cellar Hotel in Calderbridge near Egremont. Katie. 
Hi Ian, yeah, John has taken some time out of his busy day, we're in his kitchen, but he's joined us to, um, to tell us about his world record breaking attempt. John, the key to this, as we heard, was the ostrich egg, but you had some difficulty getting hold of it, didn't you? I should just warn some people at home, we're going to see some pictures, there's some flashing images, but tell us how you eventually got hold of the ostrich egg. Okay, well, the thing with the ostrich egg was that I'd done a couple of trial runs uh, and I'd been using a farm in Lincolnshire for my ostrich eggs and I contacted them a couple of weeks prior to this record breaker and said, right, I need another couple of eggs, please. And they said, I'm sorry, John, but um, they've stopped laying. We don't have any ostrich eggs. And I was, oh my word, what am I going to do? So they gave me some numbers up and down for people up and down the country and I gave them a ring uh, and they didn't have any either. <clears throat> so I went on the internet and found this lovely lady in Mexico who breeds and rears ostriches and she kindly sent us uh, an egg over. So it went from Mexico to Los Angeles and Los Angeles to Heathrow where it was stuck in customs and that was probably the most nervous I've been because um, I just wasn't sure whether this egg was going to arrive. So some <laughs> poor customs official in Heathrow nearly thwarted the attempt so you were stressed before it even started but John you're a chef so you're used to stressful situations. What was it like on the day when you were actually doing it? What could have got, gone wrong? What were you worried about? Um, I was extremely nervous because there is there is so much that could have gone wrong. Uh, we only had the one egg, um, which which in itself is bad because um, if I'd have dropped it or, or I'd have split it when we were cracking it open, uh, that would have been the attempt. That would have been the attempt gone. Uh, I could have crushed it with the sheer weight of the sausage meat, and of course I could have I could have actually just failed by not making it in the first place. So that was very stressful. But none of that <laughs> happened. You got the world record. And um, before we turned up today, we didn't even know John was going to do this, but he has made us a Scotch egg. John, uh, to scale, how does this compare to the actual world record attempt? Um, well, compared to the world record attempt, this is minute. But this is uh, this is one that we made earlier. Pardon the pun. And it's 150 grams okay the one that we made and broke the real record with was an 11 kilo just over 11 kilos in weight so we would need 60 of these this size to make up the one that we uh, broke the record with well we're out of time there John unfortunately I can tell you John might be doing a Cumberland world record attempt soon we could be back here in a few months who knows thanks Katie